Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. This reading is for anyone with their sun, moon, or rising in the sign at Aries. There's going to be a divine guidance reading for you. There's going to be a short message to see what you need to know at this time. Okay, so let's get into it. Spirit, what's the message for Aries, sun, moon, rising? What do they need to know at this time? Aries, sun, moon, rising. What do they need to know at this time? Aries, sun, moon, rising. All right, there is a masculine here. This could be a father figure, an authority figure, some man, okay? He doesn't have to have a child or children, but I feel like some of you, this is like a baby's father or a, a husband, ex-husband, your own father, maybe even there's something going on with this man. They're not happy is what I'm getting. Something about them being unhappy about something, okay? Let me see the emperor reverse here, spirit. This could be someone who's power hungry. Okay. This could be a cancer or someone with cancer in their birth chart. This man could have cancer in his birth chart or you do. And something about them being power hungry. Because the emperor can be a controlling masculine, okay. Um... This could be someone in your family because cancer is the fourth house. Fourth house is uh, connected to home, family, mother. So there could be something about mother, father. You could be the mother. And this is like, like I said, maybe you have a child or children with this man. Or this is your own father. I don't know. There's something about power hungry, though. Some of you, this person is very moody. Okay. Even the four cups is connected to the energy of cancer. And this person, as you can see here, they're not happy here. They could be in a very moody energy is what I'm getting. The sun card is reversed. That's happiness. And I do see something about a child or children could be significant for some of you. Because the page of cups could be a child. The sun card could represent children. So you may have a child or children with this person. See, there's a little child here. And then the Page of Cups can speak to a young child. If it's not that, there's something about an offer because the Page of Cups can also represent an offer. You could be offering this person something or somebody's offering this person something or they're trying to offer you something. But somebody here is closed off to an offer, though. There's something about being closed off to opportunities or offers you or this person. Okay. This person's stagnant in their life. They're not happy. And something about them wanting to control things, being power hungry. Okay, the Emperor Reverse. I want to get more on him. He could be a heavy drinker. Heavy drinker here. And then when he drinks, he gets moody. Because the cancer, cancer, every sign has negative and positive traits. Cancer's negative trait is being, you know, moody. Okay? Like a crab. Being very crabby, moody, irritable, easily, ir you know, easily irritated. You could be in a toxic relationship with this person or maybe this is someone you dealt with in the past or this person's in a toxic relationship. Let's see. Rideshare company. There could be something about an Uber Lyft company or some sort of rideshare company if it's not Uber Lyft is significant. I don't know if you're if they drive for Uber Lyft or you do or if maybe somebody's getting a Uber Lyft or they did in the past and that's significant. Or if it's not, like I said, it could be something about a ride share company. Doesn't, it could be like a taxi service, a shuttle service. I don't know. But there's something about a ride share company. There could be something about some travel then. Because the three of wands can indicate travel. There's something about making plans for the future here. You could be receiving a message or a phone call. Or someone here is receiving some sort of message or a phone call. And something about making plans for the future. Okay. Um, fragile ego. This person has a fragile ego. Something about can't handle loss or rejection or this person could be very defensive. 
something about their ego is fragile they're very defensive they could be very insecure whoever this man is i'm picking up on there could be some family secrets with this man okay so we'll pause there something about some family secrets this person has some sort of skeletons in the closet okay you may have to defend yourself with the seven of wands against this person this person could be trying to make you do something that you don't want to do against your will okay there could be something like a back and forth going on here this person could be very critical or they feel like they're being criticized or something because judgment is here so someone here could be under judgment for something here. They could be being criticized or um, or maybe they're criticizing you. Okay, if they're being criticized, I feel like they don't know how to handle criticism I'm getting. This person could be very defensive. There's something about their ego is very fragile, okay? There could be some like finger pointing at this person, some judgments, like... Something about that the Emperor is Aries, so it could be an Aries man. If you're watching, this could be you. Or Leo, I'm picking up Leo. I'm also getting Aquarius. Heavy fire is in this chart and water too. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, strong Cancer. Strong Cancer though. I don't know if you have a Cancer placement or this person does, but um, we got the Page of Cups, which is a Cancer energy, and the Four of Cups. And also we got some Aries energy here with the Two of Wands, Three of Wands, and the Emperor. We also got some Leo energy with the Sun card, Seven of Wands. So, and like I said, Aquarius. Oh, hold on, my light is flickering. That could be significant for some of you. Okay, something here. I get a feeling this person could be very like. They're trying to keep something in the dark. Cause why? My light is flickering, y'all. It just started flickering. I don't know. Hold on. If it goes out, then. Hold on. Let me see something here. Yeah, it was flickering. So something about them. They don't want something. They could be mad. I'm getting a mad energy too. They don't want something coming out. They don't want me to communicate this to you because my light is flickering heavy. Clarify what's going on here. For Aries. Clarify this reading for Aries. Person got mad. This person could be watching me mad. Occupation. Somebody here is working on something. You could be working at a job. This could be a boss of yours or something for some of you. Or there's something that you're putting work into. Some of you are focused on your career, growing a business, uh, planning for the future. Some of you have a lot of options available to you. You could be broadening your horizon. Some of you are doing something with marketing, networking. You could be on networking. like a. You could be on social media I'm picking up, a platform. You could be doing something here where you're getting a lot of attention. Wow. <laughs> I knew it was going to go out, y'all. Hold on. Let me fix that. It might not be plugged in all the way or something. Yeah, this person doesn't like that. They really could be angry. I'm picking up that you're getting a lot of attention. Some, something you're doing for your life purpose here. There's something about your North Node, your destiny. It's something you were called to do with the trumpet. You're answering the call. See how these people are looking up there answering the call? There's something about they're mad about you answering the call here. This, this is someone who doesn't take action on things. This is someone who could be very stagnant in their own life. And you're very focused on your career, your goals and everything. Like I said, you could be broadening your horizons. Some of you, you put this person behind you for some of you. Some of you, you turned your back on this. You're focusing on your future or something because the two of wands can be like, I've been there, done that with something and I'm looking toward the future. Like I'm done with this. I've conquered that or dealt with that. I'm now looking to the future. So this person could be in the past, but there, there's something about that. Um, yeah, this person could be trying to um, force something here. I'm picking up something about forcing you against your will or they're angry about something. They're moody. Anyway, something you're doing is going to get you a lot of attention. Like I said, you're going to be in the spotlight. This person doesn't want you in the spotlight, but you're going to be there anyway. I'm not saying you're going to be a celebrity. Some of you could end up being a celebrity, but 
some of you, this is something that you're doing. You're, you're going to be getting a lot of attention, a lot of recognition, some sort of talent, skills, abilities that you have is going to put you in the spotlight. It's like your calling. It's your north node. It's your destiny. This person doesn't like that, though. Clarify. You could be 34 or someone here could be 34. This person could be 34 years old or something. Yeah, something's ending here. Something has ended or will be ending in this situation. Also, there could be something about you ending a career path to go down another career path. There could be an ending or a change in your career, okay? It doesn't have to be an ending. But something, some phase could be ending. Something's being brought to an end. Also, there's something about a passing. See the coffin here? And then we have coffins down below. That's what they're rising up out of. Okay, I'm also getting because I had the card of family secrets and I wrote taking info to the grave here. Someone here wanted to take some information to the grave. Something with these, that's why I'm getting graves here, like coffins and, and uh, coffins down below. This person wanted to keep some secrets here, but they're being brought back up because the judgment card, the coffin, see how they're rising up out of these coffins. It could talk about a resurrection of something here. This could talk about something from the past coming back up. Something from the past coming back out. Something's being uh, dug back up that this person doesn't want to be dug back up. They were trying to take it to the grave. These family secrets, these skeletons in the closet that they have. Some of you, there could have been something about um, a passing or something. I don't know if this person passed. This father or this is something coming up or this they could have there could have been something about a passing if it's not that then something's ending here okay a message of concern there is going to be a message like i said a message of concern could be coming in towards you you could be born on the 19th or something could have happened when you were 19 years old or this something about 19 years ago or 2019 could be significant or you're born on the 19th or this person. Same with 14. You could have been born on the 14th here or this person. You're born on the 14th or they are. Or something's going to happen on the 19th or the 14th. Or something something about 14 years, 19 years ago. Or you, something happened when you were 14 years old. Something about 14 for some of you. There's something about a message of concern you could be receiving. There's going to be like a message. Page of Cups can talk about a message and so can the judgment card because the trumpet can represent an announcement. And yeah, this person's concerned. I feel like they have some sort of concerns. Someone here could be 33 or 34 years old. Someone here is 33 or 34 years old. You or them. This person, I feel like they're the ones concerned about their secrets coming out. They're very concerned about this. Also, 1933 could be significant or 1934. This person could be an older person. Born in 1933 or 1934. Or 2014 could be significant if I didn't mention that. Great fortune. Yeah, you're, somebody here is coming into great fortune. Somebody here is definitely coming into great fortune in this situation. Um... Somebody's getting a wish fulfilled. It has something to do with their life purpose, their destiny. Somebody here's going to hear good news about something. Their ships are coming in. If you've been waiting on news or information, or if you've been like sending your ships out and waiting for a return, it's almost like casting a fishing pole, right? A fishing rod and bringing in the big fish, okay? Because I'm seeing a fish here. And somebody here, those ships in the distance represent the fish coming in he's cast his uh fishing rod and then the fish are coming in the big fish there's something about something coming in okay let me get more on that what's the three of wands here a big change is imminent get ready a big change is imminent here get ready Leave this toxic relationship behind it does not serve you anymore there's a relationship in your life whether it's love whether it's any sort of relationship, there's a toxic relationship. This could be a family relationship. Leave this behind. It does not serve you anymore is what Spirit is saying. Okay. Maybe you're already doing this in the process or you had already. 
Okay, what else here? Somebody here could be from Kansas. There's something about Kansas. Or I'm getting, we're not in Kansas anymore. Something about the yellow brick road. Something about the Wizard of Oz and the yellow brick road or something I'm picking up. Dorothy, someone's name could be Dorothy. Something about this emperor. Remember everybody in the movie Wizard of Oz was lacking something. The scarecrow didn't have a heart. The, the, no, was it a heart? No, the scarecrow didn't have a brain or something like that. I think the Tin Man didn't have a heart and the lion didn't have courage. So this person doesn't have a brain, courage or heart to do something here. They don't have the heart, they don't have the courage, and they don't have the brains is what I'm getting. Something like that, y'all. Something about that, that movie, The Ye Wizard of Oz. Because I'm hearing, we're not in Kansas anymore. There's something about that movie. Hmm. And the man behind the curtain, remember? Something about that, remember there was something where he was like scaring everybody, but when they pulled back the curtain... They weren't as big as they acted like they were. Something like that. Y'all know the movie if y'all seen it. Clarify for Aries. Or something about Kansas, okay? Somebody here could have went to school in Kansas. Like college, grade school. Somebody used to live there or is moving there or currently lives there. Or this could be someone's favorite sports team is out of Kansas. I don't know. Is it Kansas Chiefs or something? I believe something about Kansas Chiefs. Or something could have happened in Kansas or something. I don't know. Withdrawn. So somebody here is withdrawn. This person could be in a energy of being withdrawn. Or people are withdrawing their energy from this person. Which is, you know, there's something about that. This person could be very withdrawn. Karma is a B. They're getting karma here for something. No justice, no peace. No justice. No. So there's something about there needs to be justice. There's going to be no peace until there's justice. Clarify. Victim. This person, there needs to be justice for this person. Um, they're victims. They have victims or a victim. There's, this person could have caused somebody to pass away. I don't know if it was a child or, or an adult. Something about 19, 14. That could be, or 26 years old. Or somebody here is born on the 26th. Somebody could have did something. There's something about that. Something about the year 2026 will be significant. There's going to be a message of concern. Something, some of you, something about a passing is significant. There's no justice, no peace. Something could have happened to someone. No justice, no peace. Maybe something happened to the emperor or the emperor did something. Okay. This person power hungry, fragile ego. This person has victimized people. Whether they abuse them, harm them, hurt them in any way or something. There's something they have victims. Clarify. Weapons will form but shall not prosper. Weapons will form but shall not prosper, Spirit says. Lying about their whereabouts. This person could be hiding out and lying about their whereabouts or someone here is lying about where they are. Clarify. Calm down. Somebody here could be worked up. This person could be worked up. They could be worried. They could be stressed, living in fear. Or somebody here lying about their whereabouts is in fear. Maybe in fear of this person or this person is trying to hide out or something. Somebody's lying about their whereabouts. Okay. And somebody here is worked up, stressed. A cancer is being targeted. Somebody here could have targeted a cancer or something about July. June, July could be significant. The target month is, is in June, July. Or there's somebody targeting someone with cancer in their chart. A cancer is being targeted for something. They're the target of something. Whether they're innocent or not. Something about a uh, cancer is the target. Clarify. Customer service. Something about customer service is significant. I don't know if somebody works in customer service. Or you may hear from somebody in customer service, a message, clarify. You could be the customer or not. Something about a uniformed employee. 
you could be a uniformed employee or this person is or you could be speaking to a uniformed employee something about customer service clarify not no time for games somebody here doesn't have time for games i don't know if somebody's playing games or something but somebody here doesn't have time for it something about games clarify don't give up you're almost to the finish line something about you being at the finish line almost to the finish line it's like you're running some sort of a marathon and you're almost to the finish line it's like your hard work is paying off don't give up something that you're working to war clarify you may have to defend your position stand your ground a mother figure is significant which i figured clarify for aries they love the f out of you somebody here loves you somebody here loves loves you so much maybe a mother does maybe this masculine did something to a mother or something or that maybe they did something to a child and they're coming through to tell their mother if they lost like say this i'm getting a scenario with this masculine he did something to a, a child or a mother either way the child or the mother is coming through or from the other side to tell you they love the f out of you they miss you they love you i'm almost wanting to cry like there this is from a message from beyond the grave they don't want you to give up on something i don't know if you're fighting for justice for this child or this mother they said no justice no peace no justice no peace something about they lied about their whereabouts maybe to the authorities or something weapons will form but shall not prosper this person wanted to take they had victims somebody was victimized or a victim of someone karma is a b somebody here is hiding out in solitaire i don't know they could be hiding out in kansas or something i don't know or from kansas some about family secrets heavy drinker toxic relationship power hungry a big change is imminent person could have been a heavy drinker when they drink they lose their temper or something clarify pressing charges you could have pressed charges or someone else something about pressing charges there could have been threats domestic violence harassment assault something could have been stolen there was some, something about pressing charges here okay clarify drugs Somebody here could have did something. There was something about drugs, a heavy drinker. Clarify for Aries. Envy. Somebody here is envious of you or envious of someone. There's somebody here that's envious. Clarify. Spiritual doorways are opening up for you to new opportunities. There's something about spiritual doorways. Clarify. Stolen property. Somebody could have stole some property from you. This could have been something to do with an inheritance situation. Some of you, something happened to a father figure. I'm getting that small for some of you or the father figure did something. Clarify. If the father figure, if something happened to a father figure, they also love the F out of you. You could be a mother figure that has kids with this father figure. Some of you, it's this father figure is a narcissist though. Some of you, some somebody here is a narcissist. Clarify if it's not the father figure. Clarify or has narcissistic tendencies something about looks or behaves like a clown or acts foolish somebody here looks or beha behaves like a clown and acts foolish this person could be on drugs alcohol clarify healer you could be a healer somebody here is a healer with the star card you're a natural born healer you can heal yourself you can heal others you may work as like a nurse i'm picking up somebody here could be a nurse or work at the hospital or someone here does reiki Somebody here could work in a healing field where they heal or help others. It could be any field where you are helping or giving advice or healing others. Therapy, whether it's physical therapy, um, behavioral therapy. Somebody here works in a healing type of field. It could be a nutritionist. Somebody could be a reader, a tarot reader. Somebody could be an astrologer. Something being aligned. I'm getting something about in alignment. The stars are aligning in your favor older female is involved there's some of the older female that's 36 and up is significant some of the older woman expect the unexpected 
something sudden un unexpected or this was in the past or this is coming up expect the unexpected expected there's some sort of big change that's imminent clarify they want you to get ready abusive to minors this person's abusive to children this father this could be an abusive father clarify alcohol this person drinks a lot of alcohol person has an addiction to alcohol clarify solar eclipse something about that solar eclipse energy that's you're being affected by that aries i don't know if it's because it happened during aries season the solar eclipse i don't know there's something about that solar eclipse that total solar eclipse okay the sun right the solar the sun is solar the moon is lunar something about that in this man it's reverse in this man solar eclipses bring about new beginnings okay clarify fertility someone here can be pregnant or they're going to be experiencing a lot of growth someone here could be pregnant or they're going to be experiencing a lot of growth in some area of their life one more rejection is God's protection something about rejection I don't know if you rejected someone or they rejected you but it was for your protection also Montana could be significant someone's name could be Hannah Hannah I'm getting something about Hannah Montana okay so someone's name could be Hannah or they're from Montana or Kansas that's not gonna be for all of you okay that's significant to somebody watching but it doesn't mean it's not your reading it's just somebody watching something about lying about their whereabouts they could have been lying saying they were somewhere else they weren't their alibi isn't lining up or something some of this person's alibi i don't know if they cheated or they harmed or hurt a child i don't know something about lying about their whereabouts clarify what's going on here clarify this reading for aries sun moon rising clarify this reading for aries aries sun moon and rising signs clarify this reading the peacemaker somebody here is trying to play the peacemaker in this situation or something's coming in there's going to be peace any trouble or misunderstandings between friends or lovers are now healed reconciliation and reunion is possible now there could be a rebirth a resurrection a healing of a relationship someone here wants to make peace with you or you them or this is something about no justice no peace no justice no peace it may not have anything to do with healing a relationship but there's going to be a peace there's going to be peace there's going to be justice there's going to be peace there's been some sort of troubles misunderstandings between friends family whatever lovers there could be a reconciliation or a reunion that's possible for some of you with something here uh opportunity to heal a situation but some of you this is just about that no justice no peace there's going to be justice something there's going to be a peacemaker whether it's your angels because i see an angel something about this angel is going to bring peace i don't know if you can see she has wings those white wings on either side of her somebody here is an earth angel or is, is an angel because look at the angel wings here this angel there's some angel here bringing peace i don't know if this is a mother or what but the somebody here's going to be bringing peace to something here the warrior yeah you may have to battle or fight for something here you could be a warrior a spiritual warrior or someone here is there's some sort of battle something about you discovering your warrior spirit or someone here is defending themselves discovering their warrior spirit illuminate subconscious i'm sorry yeah illuminate subconscious fears to defeat and command respect of your enemies somebody here is illuminating their subconscious fears to defeat and command respect of their enemy something about warrior spirit someone here has a warrior spirit the spy someone has their eye on you what's done behind the scenes will soon be revealed nothing will escape you yeah remember when they drew back the curtain in the wizard of oz remember remember the part of the wizard of oz where the guy was behind the curtain and they pulled it back and realized he was just like a little tiny person i believe but it that's just symbolic of something's going to be revealed somebody's true colors or who they really are is going to be revealed something about they've been watching you 
somebody's been watching this person or they've been watching someone or some something about that someone has their eye on you or eye on somebody and what's done behind the scenes will be revealed target somebody here was being targeted look at this target that was on someone that's a target The observer. Yeah, someone here's been observing someone or observing a situation. Something about observe rather than participate. Gather information and see what is significant and what could be safely ignored. Okay. Something about red eyes is significant. Red eye. I'm noticing her eye is red. I don't know the symbolism or what red eye means, but. Or this could be something about travel, catching a flight, red eye. I don't know. If somebody's eyes could be red from drugs, drug use or alcohol use. I don't know if they smoke a lot of marijuana. I don't know. I'm getting some about red eyes. Something about the spy and the observer. Someone here is gathering information. Something about a cancer is being targeted here. Okay, let me see something else. Clarify this reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising. Clarify this reading for Aries. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising. Clarify this reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising. Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Clarify this reading for them. Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay, that's good. Do not take risk. Be careful. Something about someone here taking risks. Maybe they're telling you don't take risk when it comes to this person. Or someone here took a risk. There's something about the birth or conception of a child is significant. Something about the birth or conception of a child or an enterprise. This could be a business. This could be speaking to the three of wands. If it's a business, there's going to be the birth of some sort of enterprise or something. Or there's something about the birth of a child. There could be an announcement. Someone here is behaving stupidly. It could be like a father figure or something. something about someone's behaving stupidly. This emperor? Something about a crib, a child? Hidden secrets can harm you. This person's trying to take secrets to the grave, I'm telling you. Hidden secrets can harm you. Do, be careful, don't take risks. Something with this man. Work, yeah, you're going to have work achievement success. You're almost to the finish line with something. Something that you're working on. Or something about work. This person going to be at work. Plenty of material things. You're going to have that. Whatever you're working on, you're going to have plenty of material things. You're going to have great fortune. A long journey, either physical or mental, is going to leave you wiser at the end. There's some sort of journey, whether it's physical travel trip. This could be cross country, overseas to another country, state to state. But some sort of long journey, either physical or this is a mental journey that you've been on with this situation, will leave you wiser at the end. Hmm. Hidden secrets can harm you. Rejection is God's protection. Someone here has a fragile ego. Someone here likes a lot of alcohol and they're abusive to minors. Expect the unexpected. Older female, 36 and up. Natural born healer. Somebody here is in clownish behavior. Looks or behaves like a clown. Acts foolishly. Someone's behaving stupidly like a clown. Someone's behaving stupidly. It's narcissist. Something about they stole some property. Something about stolen property of something. Something belongs to someone else and they stole it? Envy, drugs, pressing charges for theft, threats, assault, domestic violence, harassment. Leave this toxic relationship behind with this power hungry, drinking, alcoholic, mood swing, having, fragile ego, insecure, toxic relationship, having. I don't know. This person's very, yeah. Maybe this person, be careful because this person can't handle rejection person could be withdrawn or they're hiding out lying about their whereabouts or something or they lie like oh I wasn't there uh, that wasn't me that's not my that's not my fingerprints at the scene of the crime I'm getting that something about weapons weapons were used or they're they're trying to use some sort of weapon something about a cancer is being targeted or someone with cancer in their birth chart or they're being they're the target of a raid or something or an investigation could be that too they're, you're almost to the finish line. Don't give up, mother figure. They love the F out of you. You're almost there. Your ship's coming in. Three pe There's something about working together with people in the community. You could be a student or a teacher. Or speaking to someone who's knowledgeable. Someone here could be working with a group of people. 
looking into something here or learning something or there could be something about training, learning, college, school. Some of you, you're being guided down the right path. You're being led. Somebody here, the, the hermit is an observer. This is someone who sheds light on what's in the dark or is very intelligent. They could give advice to others. They could be a teacher, mentor. Like I said, there could be something about your, you're getting ready to become wiser. The hermit is a wise person. Long journey, either physical or mental, is going to leave you wiser. It's like you're on some sort of spiritual journey. Okay. I don't want, I said this is going to be a short message, but I'm about to wrap it up here. Okay. <laughs> Clarify this reading. Clarify this reading for Aries. Somebody may drive a motorcycle. I just heard a motorcycle go by. Very loud, too. So something about a motorcycle. Clarify for Aries. Person can drive a Harley. I'm picking up a Harley. This person may have like a bike. I'm getting something about a biker gang or a biker beard or something. You know the biker gang where the men have those long beards. Anyway, what else here for Aries? Clarify one more. Aries, sun, moon, rising. Clarify this reading for them. Wasting time. Something about them wasting your time or wasting time. Something about their waste of time. Something about stuck, no changes, limited with this person. Something about wasting time and they're running. You could be running or running away from this person or you like to run or something. I don't know. Something about running. Ain't shit. This person ain't shit. It literally says ain't shit. <laughs> person ain't shit you should run from this run far away something about time to leave this relationship behind you should be in a running something about you oh running right you don't give up you're almost to the finish line it's like you're running some sort of race or something don't give up you're almost to the finish line take a deep breath she's taking a deep breath in something about calm down take a deep breath you're almost to the finish line no time for games. Calm down. Yeah. Ain't ish. That's what I'm getting this person. Spiritual hater. This person could be a spiritual hater hating on your spirituality. This person hates on your spirituality. They hate your light. They hate the magic that you hold, the power that you hold. Because you're more powerful than you realize, I feel. Yeah, your light irritates their demons. Something about you shine bright. Your light irritates their demons. You're the star. Your light, they hate your light. It's almost like they, yeah, they don't like it. It irritates us. This person has a lot of demons. Yeah. This person could definitely be a water sign because it's poking out Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This could be an ex of yours because I see the two of cups reverse. This person could be an ex of yours. This person is not happy with their own life. Something about they're not, their wishes aren't being fulfilled. Some of you, they're very arrogant and selfish with the Nine of Cups reverse. They're in this Five of Swords energy, harboring anger and resentment towards you. Some of you had a falling out with this person. You could have gotten to some sort of arguments, fights, conflicts with this person, ranging from violence or verbal or physical abuse for some of you. This person's an alcoholic. That's why they're the King of Cups reverse. They could definitely have a Cancer placement or a Pisces placement or a Scorpio placement. Anyway, that's it. Let me know how it resonates. Um, just know that you are. Let me pull like three more. You are on the right side of this. Your divine masculine messed up a divine union. Yep. Two of Cups reverse. This person could definitely be a Cancer with the crabs in a barrel mentality. Now they want to hold you back. They have a crabs in a barrel mentality. And Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising could be in their chart. All right, I'm done. Bye.